Hey, ChatGPT just had a huge update and they've added these folders called projects. So I'm gonna show you where it is and how magical it is. So over on the left-hand side, you know, I have a, a million custom GPTs in here. <laughs> you're gonna scroll down below your custom GPTs and you're gonna see something that says projects. That's where you'll create, I was gonna say connect, but you'll actually create the folders. So um, I'm gonna start by creating them for our clients. So I'm gonna create one here that says, chance theater i'm going to create this project and then now any chat that i'm doing that has to do with the chance theater i'm going to move into this chance theater folder so this project folder not only has the ability to organize your chats it also gives you the ability to have like a base knowledge base behind these projects, which is so awesome. So your custom instructions can be customized based on the folder. So in here, like um, this is where you can put the basics of your custom GPTs and instructions, which I just think is so cool. And then here you can load files. So like your company details and all of that. I don't know if I have the one in here, I may have it. Let me see if I have the chance brand voice on this computer. I don't think I do, but that's where I would load that. I'm on my laptop because I'm traveling, but I have it in a Google doc, right? So I can um, add that, download it and add it later. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come over here and this like Emma musical promo caption, I'm gonna go like this and I'm just gonna add it to the project. And then that chat is gonna show up under here. I was also just working on this end of your email campaign, add that to this project. So now the things that I have worked on for this brand can all be inside this project. And there can be custom instructions in addition to the custom GPTs that I can use. I'm going to do a deeper training to this, but I am so excited about this. Really? Like, look, all of these can be moved. Then you can also maybe stop creating so many different ones if you don't need them. I don't know why there's all these newsletter ones, but we write a lot of newsletters for them. Um, pretty cool, right? This one was the chance. And then, so like this one I used for captions for them. I can just use this same one in the future for this captions, right? Rather than creating a million different chats like I always do. Okay, and then when you wanna come back to it, so let's say I'm just like in regular chat GPT, when I wanna access those, I can just go like this and there it is. It's so cool. Let me show you again. I wonder if there's a way to like make it minimized because that could get crazy if you have a bunch of things in there there perfect goes oh they're so cute open close <laughs> amazing and then check out right here also you can decide what tools you want to use with it so this is new as well you can decide these tools right here but you can also bring these tools into these projects so when you're in the project, you can decide hello, and you can chat, start a new chat inside this project just by typing right here. So instead of having to create it up here, when I'm going to do something for my brand, I'm just going to do it in here and it will create the file in here. I am so excited. I do have my brand voice, I think, on here. Let's see. Do I not? I think it may say brand messaging. TPP brand messaging. Oh my gosh, it must not be downloaded on my computer. But I'll do that later. Okay, anyway, I think it's amazing. Uh, really cool. Enjoy. Goodbye.